Hi, I'm Deborah Anker. I'm clinical professor of law and director of the Immigration Refugee Program, clinical program here at law school. I'm here today to announce the 2016th edition of my book, Law of Asylum in the United States. It's a treaty, treatise, very comprehensive on U.S. asylum law and both a domestic and an international perspective on the law. And students work with me really closely every year to update it. It has to be an updated on an annual basis. And so it's very current. There's, in this, in this edition in particular, there's a discussion of um, domestic violence as a basis for asylum and advances in the law since the breakthrough decision of the Board of Immigration Appeals in 2014, which our clinic was instrumental in, in um, making happen. And there's also discussion of transgender asylum, asylum based on transgender status, um, and um, and and a more advanced discussions of of people fleeing cent Central Americans fleeing gang warfare and the various bases on which they can get asylum protection in the United States. So this is a typical treatise. It tries to really synthesize the law, uh, describe the various doctrines that have emerged in the courts and in the administrative agencies and also how those doctrines can be interpreted in a way that makes them coherent and consistent uh, with the underlying legislation and treaty that is the basis for our, our refugee and asylum law. So I'm very grateful to the students who've worked on it with me and I've also had a couple of alumni who've been working on it with me Ting Chen and um, Helen Lawrence this year. Uh, people in this office have helped me with it. It's definitely not a one-person show. If you'd like to buy a copy of the book, you can, it is published by Thomson Reuters, a legal publishing firm that also runs Westlaw. And many of you know about Westlaw, and if you have free access to Westlaw, you can have free access to the book. But otherwise, you can buy it um, through Thomson Reuters. Mm -hmm.